audio seemed fine, but if it is too loud, anyone, please let me know. Oh, don't turn to my truck. Okay. Do not mean to do that. Um, difficulty. So, this has more options than I anticipated. So, I normally play all my horror adventures on easy because I am a baby bitch. But I am willing to move it up to easy off of story at the very least because I have minimal experience, at least now, with the Resident Evil. So, this shouldn't be as bad that I need to go full story. But at the very least, something. Enemies and Isaac both take baseline damage, but something still a little bit. Ease me in, because this is something a little bit new as well. Um. I don't think I need that. English subtitles. I think otherwise, everything is good. Hopefully, nothing else breaks. I'm waiting. Okay. I am going to just a tad turn it up on brightness. And one down. Something's still a bit dark, but still not the barely really visible. Something a little bit above barely visible. Um I don't wanna resume. Oh wait, no. I accidentally paused it. That was what <gasps> I knew this game was just gonna give me trouble from the moment I started seeing oh, it's freaking windowed mode is the tiniest little thing. I think it's me. Oh, I wish I could talk to you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about everything. Oh, I just wish I could talk to someone. It's all falling apart here. I can't believe what's happening. Strange. Such a little thing. That's her? Nicole? Yeah. First I've heard from her in weeks. We're five minutes out, you still got that thing on repeat? Guess you really miss her. Bishamer is not a job you turn down, but six months apart with only fit calls? It's rough. Easy to say the wrong thing. I don't Oh yeah, I just I didn't to my girlfriend over talk to the original protocols. If we I remember correctly. So you keep saying Here we go. Nice clean re-entry. Imagine six months staring at that chunk of rock. To an independent miner, that's paradise. Aegis 7 is one of the richest finds in CEC history. Some prospecting team set up for life. Now, where is she? <laughs> there. Confirming visual contact with USG Ishimura. What a beauty. <laughs> Biggest planet cracker in her class, you know. And it looks like they already popped the cork. Why is it so dark? We should be able to see her running lights. Yeah. I'll get us into hailing range. Someone's got to be waiting up for us. Just be careful on the approach. I'm not taking any chances with the CEC's pride and joy. No chances, huh? Is that why you were digging into my personnel files before we left? Mm -hmm. Check your file access? I'm a computer analyst. It comes with a job. I ran standard CEC background checks, Miss Daniels. If you want to work in the big leagues, you have to play ball. <coughs> Sir, we're in hailing range. USG Ishimura, this is the emergency maintenance team of the USG Kelly responding to your distress call. Come in, Ishimura. Ishimura, do you copy? Come in. This is the USG Kelly. You ever hear of a full communications blackout on one of these things? Never. Come on. Someone picked up the damn phone. That doesn't sound good. <laughs> Uh, sound like their communication array is busted. Maybe a uh, broken encoder. Daniels and I can handle it in 48 hours, max. Hey, that gives you plenty of time to catch up with Nicole. Yeah, I hope so. Jen, Johnson, take us in. 
gravity tethers engaged. Automated docking. Let's go. I'm losing control. I was about to ask how quickly things went to shit, but what the fuck? <laughs> I think we're gonna be here for more than 48 hours. I'll live. Hey, John's still. Alright. It's my ankle. I'd be broken. Shit. But better than a broken neck. Or worse. Good call on the stabilizer, Isaac. Bet I always read the manual. What the fuck's going on with flight control? That guidance system's a death trap. Better add it to your repair list. Jen, what's our damage? Calm her down. We lost poor booster. We've got a fire in one of the stabilizers and. Singularity core is a mess. Could be worse, but not by much. Then let's get some help. Johnston, stay with the Kelly. We'll send a medic. Everyone else, with me. Now to have the helmet on. Okay. Okay. Crap, we came down hard. Not a great start. Aha. Uh, okay. No, no voice audio. Okay, I guess it's text. So, uh, to Zach Hammond from who knows. <laughs> Background request. Per your request, here's what we could find on these specialists. And stay sent for the repair mission. Isaac. Isaac Clark. Isaac was born to Paul and Octavia Clark on Earth in the Eastern Seaboard region, region of the American Republic. Like, Paul Clark was an award winning ship architect employed by the Galactic Union Merchant Marine Corps. His record show. Dark, we've already crashed. That's already out of the water. Shit's already happened. Uh, his record show seemingly time off, off world away from his family. When Isaac was born, Paul was given a temporary reassignment to an Earth based gum MC ship product production facility. During the four-year tour, war, Paul and Octavia raised Isaac together. And when the tour was over, where Paul shipped off for an extended off-world tour, Paul's influence when on his son must have rubbed off. Records indicate Isaac pursued a study in mechanical and electrical engineering and achieved his high honor. Achieved high honors. Uh, according to medical and psychiatric reports, Paul. Paul Clark's absence has profound effect on Octavia. She suffered from depression and personal anguish until doctors encouraged her to find fulfillment by working with charitable organizations. It is believed that this was how she ended up coming in contact with the Church of Unitology. <laughs> Sounds culty. At first, her association with the church appeared to be uh, to alleviate her mental condition, the cancellation of her therapy sessions corresponds with the local parish announcements of her initiation ceremony. There are indications that she sold off much of the family estate to finance full membership of in the church and the soul cleanse they require to enter the higher ranks. Isaac appears to have been selected and did to a prominent engineering school. But we surmise. Uh, but we surmise that he was unable to afford the tuition, as records show that he instead attended a lesser known school with the help of a scholarship and financial assistance. 
Yeah, I guess when mom spends all the money on her cult, you don't have money to go to school. <laughs> After graduating with high honors, Isaac enlisted in the Merchant Marine. He quickly gained the reputation for his resourceful engineering solutions and after two years was promoted to a higher profile position closer to the major ship lanes. Isaac's career stagnates at this point. This would coincide with the coincide with psychiatric reports that his mother's mental health was deteriorating and bank records show that payments to the psychiatric facility for treatment. It seems to be where Isaac met a medical officer and neuroscience oncologist named Nicole Brennan and her name appears on Octavia's physician roster. The two of them ended up cohabiting until Brennan accepted a promotion and left to serve. Did you date your mom's doctor? Yeah, that's a little sketch. Uh, Paul's return from the extended tour coincided with Octavia's release from the hospital. Whatever his assignment was, Paul's service records remain mysterious. It's classified by executive order. Unless the confided in Isaac, he took his secrets to the grave. The next records we have are death notices for both Paul and Octavia. That's sketchy! Dating your mom's doctor is a little weird, I, even if you're the same age. <laughs> Their bodies were willed to the custody of the Church of Unitology, along with the Clark's entire estate. Oof. Apparently on Octavia's wishes, Isaac's repeated petitions to have his parents' bodies returned seem to have been ignored since the Church refuses is this any such inquiries related to its members, their cause of death is unknown. Overall, Isaac's more qualified to handle a job um, like the Ishimura. I take politics over religion, though. I take politics over religion, and wow, Kendra Daniels is a paragraph. <laughs> uh, I couldn't find anything on her in the times you gave me, but uh. Dralton swears by her. Apparently, she's on the mission with this recommendation. If he thinks she has what it takes, who am I to argue? I get we're trying to get, like, the main character's info, but oof. All of that for just one paragraph of Ken. Ah. I've already forgotten her name, but she will also probably be dead <laughs> very soon. <laughs> Uh, where are we going? Oh, look! It's that way. I, I... I've never played Dead Space. I've watched playthroughs of the original, so never the remake. So I have no clue what they changed, and I watched those probably ten years ago. <laughs> Do we have a run? 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 I'm trying to find a move faster button. It is not coming up. <laughs> also, y'all got guns. Oh yeah, Isaac's just an engineer right now. Hmm. At least we didn't take out the sign. Uh, actually, yeah, yeah, that makes sense. There's nothing to run from yet. I don't think I have a stomp either, and that's the other big thing on this game is getting to stomp. Isaac, come sink your rig. Rig synced. Collect kinesis and stasis modules from Acting Chief Engineer Jacob Temple. Location? Error. Employee not found. I can't read security. Same for the Chief Engineer. What is wrong with their comms? I, he, I do know he talks more because he was already talking a little bit about Nicole, particularly, and 
she never talked in the original, to my knowledge, except for maybe a couple lines toward the end. But definitely more silent pro tag. Where's the security detail? In the original? Where's anybody? There's nothing logged. No duty roster. No power to the elevator. I feel like I should be able to stomp on that. Oh look, it's the safe station. Isaac, get a damage report. I'm gun playing around. I have a text log to read. I'm sorry. Uh, I might just skim through this because, good lord, these things are long. Uh, imagine a world with basic resource, fuel, or materials. Looking for stars, additional resources, nothing capable. Enter the Ishimura, named after a celebrated astrophysicist and the inventor of the shock point drive. Hideki Ishimura, the USG Ishimura, was the first massive planet. Cracker ships. Uh, Deep Space Expedition. Uh, 62 years old. Ishimura is still in a remarkable shape. Her equipment has been upgraded over the years, and many of her interior spaces have been retrofitted to take advantage of the current technological advances despite so many years of long service. Uh, da -da -da -da. Okay, yeah, just like a pamphlet on the issue. I might still try to read some of them, but oh man, that I wish they had. Which one? Okay, this one. <laughs> Something on the floor here. Is that? I, I need that damage report. Oh, that is blood. Okay, yep. <laughs> That's blood. That is it. So are they gonna immediately get slaughtered? Now. What have you got, Isaac? Shit. It's not just comms with the guidance system. Half the Ishimura's in the red. Engines, hull, the tramps. Oh, they're so gonna die. <laughs> could do that kind of damage to a planet cracker. Uh oh. Quarantine activated. Another malfunction? No. The quarantine systems are all fine. Oh, wait. Do you hear that? I hear it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I hear it. Hammond, take it easy. You got guns. Get those elevators running. There's something in here. What's that? Oh shit! Oh shit! Where? Where? Um. Oh, it's over there. Oh, um, bye. Bye. Sorry. Wasn't paying enough attention. Goodbye. Flashy glowy lights. Hit that. Okay. <laughs> um. <laughs> Can I get the guns yet? <laughs> doesn't have a crouch, does it? Uh, where's the tutorials on... Get to safety. We're already in a uh, bad spot. Uh... Melee? Can I stomp now? No, I cannot. I hear crew member sob. Oh, wait. Gun? Gun. 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 Gun sounds nice. Oh. 
Okay. Aim full primary fire. Rotate. Okay. Melee punch. RT punch. Stop. Okay, this is also good for just poking out to have a flashlight. Okay, that didn't break. We need to learn what is foot stompable. Um, how do I open the door? Do I, do I shoot it? die as fast as I would have hoped. Thank you. <laughs> but it's also bodies, right? Bodies can be broken. That was cruel to do to someone who just got brutally assaulted, but I didn't know if he would drop anything else. Oh, my entire back. Security request retrieved. It didn't die. We shot that fucker right between the eyes and it didn't die. Smith had to shoot its fucking arms and legs off. For God's sake, send help! So if you didn't already get the clue, shoot the legs. Okay, so B is you self back. I am going to accidentally press that and be very upset when I do. <laughs> Especially in a panic. Isaac. Oh my god, Isaac. You made it. Just. They're everywhere. Shit. Is he, uh... He's gone. Nothing I can do. What the fuck are these things? The ones I saw. Some of them were wearing Ishimura uniforms. They're the crew? How the hell can they be the crew? Look at them. We need to get to the bridge. There's a thousand people on board. Someone will be there. We can't. The tram system's wrecked. Everything's locked down because of the quarantine. And you're both repair techs. So how do we do this? Um. There's a broken tram car blocking the tunnel. It's gridlocked the system. And the data board's burned out. I can't lift the lockdown or call the tram until we get a spare from the maintenance bay. But it's all on Isaac's side of a quarantine. I'll handle it. Just make sure there's power to the repair systems. And Isaac? Yeah? I'm sure Nicole's okay. She's a doctor, right? She'll do the smart thing. Yeah. Yeah, she always does. Find somewhere safe. I'll be back soon. <laughs> I'd like to touch this. What do you mean, stand by? Give me. <laughs> It'd make me feel safer not having to do that again. <laughs> oh. Mission menu. Replace the damage strand. Find data board. Okay, down that way? Yeah, just all that way. But, locker? Okay. Ooh. Okay, things that glow. Arm friend. Okay, piece of paper, apparently not a text lock. Fuck you, game. Okay. 
Okay, I'm just gonna take your leg off in advance, and maybe then... Um... Why? Okay, I don't have a stasis module. Okay, pick up the stasis module. Hold aim. Bringing the door malfunction between you and the maintenance bay. Can you fix it? No, but I found a stasis module. I'm faster than I got it. I thought it was not that. Okay, wait. Not that. Not this one. Controller layout. Uh, sprint RT. Da, da, da. Currently aim held. Shoe contains a throw object. That shouldn't have worked. <laughs> okay, I was in the wrong button. I was in, like, Nintendo. Why? <laughs> uh... Wait, why are you on medium? I started... No wonder. I swear I said it. I don't want to have to restart, but I put it at easy. Oh, there we go. Oh, it's like difficulty. Take it down. Good lord, game. Don't do that to me. No wonder. This way, right? Right, yeah, this way. No power. Uh, why? Okay, that one still has no power, so I guess we'll still go through this one. Uh, why? I think don't bother shooting those fuckers in the head. Doesn't even slow them down. Okay, yeah, like three clues on. Those arms, legs. Does that even kill them? Or do they just stop moving? Honestly, good question. But I'll take the just stop moving. Just stop moving sounds fine to me. Message retrieved. Into engineering. You got a stasis module handy? We need one in tram maintenance stat. Claw the disengage. I got a damaged tram car on the tracks, and if the whole system is gridlocked, guess who they're calling? Temple here, sending a stasis module now. What happened to the autoloader? No idea. A lot of shit's been breaking down. I keep 
hearing things. Down in the gears, you no know one can be. You know? I know. That's the game essentially it's the horrible monster sounds with standard terrifying mass machinery. Yeah! Ooh. All the things. I... It sounded like someone was whispering in my ear. Uh, stasis recharge tunes, and... Prepare systems online. Loading system reinitialized. Warning. Autoloader malfunction. Please contact a repair technician. Manual attach flaws to initiate the repair. Give me things. Can't say I'm shocked. Do you want to come out? Catch it! Going a little bit too middle. Are you dead yet? Tram car. The autoloader's busted. But Stasis should do the trick. Just gotta time it. Great. But hurry. Okay. Sound carries down here. Replacing damaged tram car. Please stand by. I hate it here. God, it still feels too dark. Oh, hi, 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 hi. Die. <laughs> Back this way. Hi. I need the Resident Evil stuff where if the encounter's still going, the music still goes. Because <laughs> these guys are just jump scaring me because I thought one, okay, that one's dealt with, we're good. Oh no, there's like three others in the room. <laughs> Coming down? No, just there to freak me out? Music at the monster sees me isn't enough. I need- I need to... Know that I can expect to see a monster. Um... Wow, total miss. Uh, aim for the door frame. Uh, 
um, their stasis recharge up here. Apparently I missed it. Oh, safe state might not be too bad. What does that say? Uh, inside the vents. 